guys, how are you doing? This is Manga Etc. And I'm here to bring you the review for One Piece Manga Chapter 1065. And now, for me personally, it all, it all boils down to two things. That's the Straw Hat versus the Seraphim. And what Vegapunk number one, I think it was, says at the very end of the chapter. Because it is interesting stuff. And now, so, when it comes to the Straw Hats versus the Seraphim, I kind of have mix emotions about it because um i'm trying to gauge is the seraphim are they strong are they weak are they underperforming are they overperforming and like i said i've, I've got mixed feelings about it because obviously we haven't really had much of a showcase from any of them so i feel like it is kind of harsh to gauge like are they strong are they underperforming are they underperforming overperforming or underperforming but what we see from this chapter for the jimby one I, 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 again, I, I don't know. So it was basically a couple of straw hats Sanji, Robin, Frankie, Nami, Usopp versus one Seraphim, the Jimby Seraphim. And during this fight, the Jimby Seraphim shows us that he's got the abilities of the swim, swim through. He's got the usual pacifist lasers. And as expected, he knows Fisherman Karate. I think those are the three things he displayed. But it didn't seem like at any point. The Straw Hats as a group was struggling fighting this thing. And even at one point, it seemed like Frank would have been able to defeat it had he landed the hit with the laser. And now, that just leads me to think, like, okay, are you underperforming? Are you underperforming, Seraphim? Like, it's got, it's got me thinking that. Uh, but there is another takeaway line that I think came in the later chapter, which made me, which I think was basically alluding to the fact that the more the Seraphim fight, the more better experience they have, like, the better they get. So, you can then, if that is true, you can then kind of forgive, maybe, um, the Seraphim in this chapter, because maybe that was, like, I don't know, like, maybe not his first fight, but, like, you know, he's still a young boy, he's still a young buck, he still needs to gather up that fighting experience. But, I don't know, maybe the Jimby one is the weaker one of the two and the um, Mihawk, Kembo, Hancock, Kwang, they've got more experience under their belts. That's why when we saw them fighting the Blackbeard, like, they were holding their own belt, so maybe it is that. And I guess the Straw Hats were unlucky slash lucky in this fight, unlucky that they were in the fact that they didn't get to take out the Seraphim, like, while they were still young, and lucky in the fact that it was still a young one, so they could somewhat stand up to it so that's my opinions on the seraphim for now would it would that change as things go on probably probably we will but that's where they stand for now so the other thing i want to talk about is that we've seen all this future tech on egghead island which is said to be 500 years into the future and then we get hit with that revelation at the very end of the chapter where we are told egghead's not the future it's actually the past. There's a place that has been more more of the future. Nine hundred years ago, obviously that is alluding to the void century. So we possibly are gonna get some information into the void century within this chapter and just exactly what makes it so far into the future and what happened to this tech and where do we go from here kind of thing. Um but yeah, that's pretty much all I gotta say about this chapter. We do obviously meet the other Vega punks within this chapter I'll get to the, a little bit about the, the personalities right now I don't really care about all of that if I'm honest but we do get that within this chapter so I think this chapter was nothing wrong with it just a standard chapter of one piece so we get a standard rating of three star like always guys I'm asking for your thoughts and opinions if you haven't already please go to my YouTube channel but most importantly take care have a nice day